by a local disc jockey scares some Michael Jackson fans. The DJ reported that the king of pop had died from a drug overdose. It was a joke, but not everybody's laughing. Chris Ornelas is here with what people are saying about the hoax. Chris. Well, Antoinette, here in our newsroom, we got a flood of calls from people wanting to know if it was true and asking why we weren't reporting the death of a music icon. The short answer is we didn't report it because it didn't happen. The hoax happened yesterday on 97.7 The Wild. It's a rhythm and blues station owned by American General Media. A DJ reported on the air that the 50-year-old moonwalker had died from an overdose. We left a message with the program director, but he never called us back. A man who answered the phone at the station, as well as several viewers, confirmed the prank. <laughs>
and a two and a one, two, three, four. <laughs> Lisa, it's your birthday. God bless you this day. You gave me the gift of a little sister.